Well, here she is making her charge. Here she is. According to uh, Sinead O'Connor, nothing compares to you. Uh, she uh, says that uh, Marcenio Hall is the drug dealer, of, was the drug dealer of Purple Rain um, Prince. Um, uh, Sinead O'Connor has a big lead for the investigators. In the Facebook post she had yesterday, she said uh, they should hit up his sort of famous drug dealer, Arsenio Hall. Arsenio's people have denied it, and coincidentally, he talked to Access Hollywood, which is the clip we just played just before Sinead's Facebook rant, and he talked about how Prince dealt with the uh, dealt with the the hip pain. So that's a pretty big charge, right? Yeah, it's a huge charge. Yeah. He, what was he taking? Um, I don't know. They, they uh, I don't know. They've released that. Have they released it, Andrew? I don't think they have. I heard Percocet. I heard Percocet yeah. too. Yeah. What is that, by the way? I guess it's a painkiller. Yeah, it's just another. So, but opiate. Oh, it's an opiate. Which it is, is, yeah. Okay, I didn't know that. I guess it's a those, controlled so this, substance. This is the stuff that leads, everybody's saying, is leading to heroin. heroin. Yeah. 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 There are certain medications Major. like this you have to you know, present ID at the doctor's office to get the prescription. And, I mean, with e-scripts, I'm not sure how it works with the controlled substances, but I'm pretty sure that the laws for, like, Percocets or... I think the e-scripts are done so uh, your script, your prescriptions are now sent uh, via electro electronically. And I think that it, part of the reason for this is, is is because of the abuse of these prescription. I'm pretty sure. And you would have to show ID yeah. for that as well. Uh, Carly Fiorina fell off the stage on Sunday after introducing Ted Cruz in one of his rallies. And Ted did Ted did not see her, or maybe he did. Dun, Christine, dun, dun. we watched it. You said that, that he didn't see. I don't think he did, but I don't know that his wife. I mean, you look at the video and tell me what you think. But his wife. I watched it. What do, you, do you think his wife saw? I, I don't. Uh, I mean, what do you do? She <laughs> fell, and she got up quickly. I, I mean, you know, your your mind goes to that, should I get in there and help? Should I? And then she's up, and uh, what do you do? Okay, just for future it, reference. You gotta let it go. If any of y'all fall off of a stage. Just leave me there. I'm going to try to help you. You'll help. Okay. Yeah. Here is Donald Trump, though. I mean, Trump's the one throwing the, the gas on the on the flame here right you have a tuesday may 3rd carl peters in rome celebrating today carl happy birthday and danny mayer in boonville is celebrating as well danny mayer and carl peters happy birthday today you get a birthday on air by going to our news site at wybx950.com you can also join our vip club and you can send in a birthday on a postcard at wybx birthdays 9418 river road marcy 13403 the Florentine Pastry Shop birthday cake, the Florentine on Bleecker Street, will go to Carl Peters. Carl in Rome gets a cake from the Florentine. You could do so as well by going to our news site at wybx950.com. All right, two minutes away. i got to take a quick two-minute break, and the superintendent of schools from Central Valley is on the line, and we'll talk a bit about what happened last night uh, over at Central Valley, a heated exchange between parents, school board members, and the superintendent. And teachers as well involved. It was uh, something. We'll talk to the superintendent when we come right back here in two minutes on WIBX.